purchase order, VZRP's purchase order module can be a life saver for you. This video will show you how you can track and manage your purchase orders in minutes. So watch now and free yourself from all the paperwork. VZRP system. Once you are able to log in, you have to go to the purchase module and click on purchase order. Once you click on purchase order, on the right hand corner you will be able to see an option called create new. Click on that. Once you click on create new, you will also get the option to select the supplier. So now you have to enter the supplier that you might have registered in the contact module. And if not, you can also create the supplier on the spot. You just have to enter their name and other details are not mandatory so it's optional for you so you can enter the details accordingly. You can also enter the purchase order date or the shipping date as per your convenience and also add any shipping notes if in case you want to. Now over here you can enter the products that you want to place an order for via their barcode or item code or via their product name. Over here once you click on the quantity, it will show you that how much available quantity of that product you have in the system and over here the quantity that you need to mention is the quantity that you want to place an order for. Now in unit cost you can also change the pricing of your purchase price accordingly. You also get the option to upload the products via excel sheet. Now this option is only available for the existing products that are already there in the inventory. Ok. So you can just click on this upload product. Click on demo. An excel sheet will be downloaded for you over here. You can open that. And once your excel sheet is open, you will be able to see a predefined format given here where you just have to mention the product's item code, how much quantity you want to place the order for, their purchase price and the MRP. And if that product has any expiry, you have to mention their expiry and their particular date. Once you are able to fill in all these details, you can just re-upload the same sheet over here. And just click on verify. So your products will be uploaded. Now in case if you want to place an order which doesn't exist in your inventory, you can also add that product from here itself via mentioning the item code or barcode. So you also get the option to enter the new product from here itself. But this option is not available in the excel sheet that I just showed you over here in the upload product section. Okay. So once you are able to enter all the products, you can add any additional notes if you want. You also have the option to give flat discount over here. And you can just save this purchase order. So this is how you can create the purchase order. And now if you want to take the print of this particular bill, you can also click over here on this PDF. For any further queries, you can contact us on the contact mentioned in the description box and comment down below any further videos you want to see from VCRP. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe.